Hi everyone and welcome to my channel. I'm going to do a channeled love letter today from the DM to the DF. So recently in my channelings I've been picking up on big shifts happening for the DM collective. Spiritual transformation, heart awakening has been coming through um, and a heaviness as they release that old self, you know, release the ego. So DF, you may have been feeling this in your own energy as a result. Try to keep cleansing your energy. So like salt baths, listening to positive meditation music, keeps your vibration high. as they go through this shift, because um, it is pretty overwhelming whenever I channel it. Um, you might have seen that in the recent videos I've done. Okay, so I'm going to pull some cards first of all, and then deliver the messages. I currently can't sleep at night. I'm up pretty much every night thinking of you. At the moment I'm regretting so much the decisions I made in the past. I feel so bad for what I did, for the way I ran from this connection but I still feel your energy it still feels like it's alive it's hard to explain even though you're not even there I feel your energy beside me at night in particular. Sometimes I wake up very early and it's you that I think of immediately. Maybe you feel this as well. I've been through so many life lessons. This is what I now realise that I had to go through these changes. I feel so alone right now and it makes me realise 
the way I made you feel. I feel so unstable. And yet I just feel your love shining through. I see us like this in my dreams. We are like this in our dreams. It feels like another world. I'm starting to learn more about spirituality and higher level commitments. And I realize that's what this is. I realize there's more to this than I did in the past because I'm transforming. I'm going through a big spiritual transformation. My old self is releasing. I keep seeing signs that lead me back to you. I used to ignore them. I wonder if you see them too. Now I'm starting to awaken to it and realize there's more to this. This connection is so deep. It just makes me weep when I think about you not being there. I really want things to shift in my life. I'm hoping for this second chance with you. I hope you do too. I've gone through some karmic lessons. I know I had to go through. But that's coming to an end. I, I so want to release this heaviness and to work things out with you. I want us to be like this, happy together, sharing, our love. But I have issues in my home. I need to move on. That's why I'm so burdened. I have these other issues. They've made me feel quite weak. Sometimes I can't even speak. I've lost money. I have fears around money. I just feel alone like I've lost everything. I'm trying to have hope. I hope you will too. In divine timing, I feel things will change. I'm seeing 11-11. And I've looked it up and because I keep seeing it. 
And this is where I had this big realisation. One day. About this connection with you. I need to free myself from my situation. I have regrets, but it's time for me to take back control of my life. I've been controlled. The person I was with was making me feel weak, making me feel tied down. And I just had to get out. I promise I will open my heart. My heart is starting to open. Maybe you feel it. I know that great love is worth taking the steps I'm being guided to take. I want, this is what I want, to just reach out and kiss you. For us to be like we were. Please have faith and trust me. I'm going to make my decision very soon. And it always leads me back to you. I miss you, I need you, I love you. I hope you won't forget me. Sometimes I wonder if you have, if it's too late. That's what keeps me up at night. But the shake of my heart is covered in your name. I keep seeing your name in random places and I now realise what it is. It's a sign from the divine. I so wish I could turn back time. It keeps me up so much. I'm so sorry for what I did, for leaving you. Please know I do still think about you. Even though we don't talk, when you see signs about me, it's because I'm, I'm there thinking about you, daydreaming. As I said before, I feel your energy beside me at night. Sometimes before I sleep and sometimes when I wake up, I just see your image there. And I so wish you were really there beside me because you're, you're so sincere. You always were a sincere friend and I listened to other people. that gossiped, tried to interfere, made me feel trapped, but now I want to free myself and send you a sweet message. I've started to write that message. So 
sometimes I delete it and don't send it. But I'm thinking about it already. I write about you in my journal, sometimes poems. Please know a blessing is on the way. Trust that. This is the blessing. I promise I'm going to send that message soon. I'll find the courage and click send. I can't stay in this regret anymore, not knowing. Because when I'm with you, it feels like home. It's like we could spend the whole day in each other's arms and it just feels so comforting and warm. I communicate with you through music. When that song comes on that touches your heart, even though we're apart, it's a message from me, from deep within. I have so many things I want to say to you, and I will do soon, my love. Okay, everyone, so that's all I can do. Um, that was very emotional. Um, at the beginning, I started crying. I'm not sure if you picked up on that in my voice, but a lot of emotions at the moment. Um, I could really feel that. Um, but a shift happening, you know, they want, it seems, to make this change. And they're sending you signs, so look out for those. Okay, everyone, thank you for watching. I hope you've enjoyed this channeling. Sending peace, love and light to you all.